Yeah, it is uh, yeah. mainly so at least turning sunny. There are a lot of big rains down uh, through southern and eastern Palm Beach County during the day. We had a flood advisory at one point. That's now been discontinued. You can see the last of the showers starting to roll away. There's still the chance for some rainfall, especially uh, Palm Beach County into the evening. But I think our, our highest rain chances have now uh, moved off. Uh, and uh, we are looking at a clearing sky almost everywhere. We had a big storm just to, to the north of Okeechobee. That is now gone. And here's that cool front that swings in tomorrow. It should be in by late morning, early afternoon. And in behind this, it's looking like really, really nice weather. We see this sometimes when hurricanes come close to Florida, but stay off to the east. If we get a storm, a hurricane or a tropical storm that comes up through the Bahamas, you get the circulating counterclockwise, brings down that nice cool, dry air from the Carolinas. We're kind of getting a similar situation this time. Uh, it won't be quite that dramatic, but we are uh, noticing the humidity will drop in a big way this weekend, and our temperatures drop about two to four degrees, at least for the daytime highs. And it looks like it'll stick around right into uh, Labor Day. Look at the tropics, uh, really, I mean, it's crazy out there. Adalia uh, is expected to redevelop into a tropical storm. We have GERT, remember GERT? It has uh, reformed. We have Jose and Franklin. Now Franklin is now post-tropical and Jose, and they're getting entrained. Uh, the, the, uh, the Jose, and uh, they were just really merging into one big system, and this is going to pull off into the North Atlantic. I've never seen a, a really a, so many named systems so close together in the Atlantic. I, the, I can't remember another time that's ever happened. We'll take a close look at this. Uh, this is post tropical Adalia. It is forecast, to, uh, as I said, to become a tropical storm once again as it heads up into the North Atlantic. Temperatures are 80s and low 90s. It's hot and humid, and we are looking at but, uh, a big change in our conditions along beaches and boating. Not only will we have a swell from some of these systems, we're also going to have a, a pretty good northeast wind developing in behind this front, uh, so it turns pretty choppy. You're going to want a high rip current risk holiday weekend. Be careful out there. And for boaters, uh, you, uh, heading out in the inlets, it's going to be nasty, so take extra caution. 88 for high tomorrow, and the seven-day forecast, you know, lower than normal rain chances. Uh, Labor Day looks great with uh, sunshine, starts to warm up a little bit, but fair weather, nice timing with this one for the holiday weekend. Enjoy it. Steve.